yo. Sweet. Sweetness, what's his name? His game's bananas, you've been waiting. I'm about to educate you about the late great Walter Payton. Rest in peace, my dude, you was the best that ever did it. Herman wrote the book. Listen as I spit it. Racial segregation, discrimination. Couldn't stop him. Name a defense in the 80s. Guaranteed Walter dropped him. Popped them like corks. Chugging like a ferry. Had an alliance with the appliance size. Refrigerated Perry. McMahon had the arm. Sweetness had the mojo. Hand him off. So I'm having a uh, kind of a trippy moment right now. If you, uh, if you read Sweetness and you read the acknowledgments, um, you might know that I wrote about uh, a good amount about the uh, family of my wife's cousin, Kathy Lieberman. And uh, I wrote specifically, I'm writing these acknowledgments from the boyhood bedroom of Elliot Lieberman, my wife's 28-year-old cousin, and a kid who, judging by the CD rack situated, situated alongside my laptop, once had an inexplicable thing for the pop band Bewitched. Elliot's room is an ode to the eternalness of youth. There are literally trophies and academic plaques. A poster of the 1994-95 Lovables. There they are. A small wooden bat. Uh, baseball cards. Mm, don't know where they are. Uh, a pair of weather kangaroo sneakers. Those are actually gone. Um, I mean, as a result, I know the intricacies of this room by heart. The large green pillow. Boing. Um, the photo montage. Boing. Uh, dusty books lined in the shelves. Boing. Uh, and then I wrote of, of the myriad objects. My favorite item is a uh, simple one. In a corner of the room at the base of a hat rack sits what appears to be a Cincinnati Reds baseball cap. It is red and a bit bulky, and on the back, the words champion coach mark are stitched in white capital letters. So this is, uh, this is the hat right here. And uh, it belonged to uh, Mark Lieberman, who is um, Kathy, uh, my wife's cousin's uh, late husband. He passed of cancer. And like I said in the acknowledgments, when, uh, whenever I stayed here, I sort of thought about him a lot. Um, and sort of, I guess in part, sort of, uh, you know, whatever the preciousness of life, but also sort of what it's like to be raised without a father or to have to go through that in the same way that Jared and Brittany Payton did and my wife's cousins also did and what a good man he was and what a decent man he was. And uh, So I can explain it, but I haven't been back in this room in a year and a half, two years, so it's, uh, it's good to be here and uh, kind of reminds me of why I wrote the book or what I want to put into the book. Rest in Rest peace, Walter. 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 Greatest one of best. Sweetness. 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 Greatest one of best the Sweetness. NFL ever Sweetness. saw. Sweetness. Yeah. Sweetness. 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 Sweetness.